sure. Looks like there's a lot of people out there. Like, not an empty seat in the house. Ava, you're not helping. Sorry. I just, I can't believe we're at Steam Speak. It's okay, because we know our stuff, we've done the work. Now all we need to do is go out there and show them who we are. So who are we? The Solution and artificial intelligence? I'll answer that. Machines taking over the world! Blunt, but I'm sure that crossed some of your minds. That's why we'd like to introduce you to Bob the Robot! Bob is designed to assist future generations with research, medicine, and Interplanetary exploration. Well said. Win. Thanks, Bob. It was a team effort. Now we'd like to tell you one of the coolest things that Bob can do. As you can. As. Just take a deep breath and say it to me like we're down in the hideout, like when we did the podcast. As you can hear, Bob uses facial recognition and statistical analysis to give personalized verbal response. That's correct, Kat. Now, is there anything I can do for the solution here? You can show yourself off to the audience. I would love to. Bob is powered by solar power and rechargeable batteries, lowering its impact on the environment. We use biomimicry to design the solar panels, allowing its form to match its function. And because even Bob understands that scientists, engineers, and mathematicians need a break sometimes, it includes a social networking app to remind us to get out of the lab and unwind. I have scheduled a hangout for all of you tomorrow at the movies. Would you like me to snap a pic of all of you together? Yes, please. Everyone say, Steve. Steve. Laser guns. Pew, 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 pew. Okay, everyone settle. Our call should happen any second now. You mean the call with the Canadian astronaut David Saint Jacques? David Saint Jacques here. Am I talking to the solutioners? You know who we are? Well, we are kind of a big deal. <laughs> Dr. Saint Jacques, don't mind my friends. They just get a little nervous talking in front of people sometimes. Don't worry about it. I'm just so happy to feel your enthusiasm for STEAM. That's kind of our whole deal. I thought your project was really impressive. Actually, I think we could use a robot like Bob on the International Space Station. That would be awesome! So, do you mind if we ask you a couple questions? Yeah, like which do you like better? Hip-hop or EDM? Hip-hop or EDM? Can I say rock and roll? I think Riley meant more like do you have any advice for future space explorers? Well, I would say, first, you have to pursue higher education. STEAM is full of interesting topics. You gotta find your passion and pursue it. Two, take care of your body. It is your most useful tool in life, so stay healthy. And three, be a good team player. Be someone your friends can always count on. What's your favorite part about space, besides the spacesuits? That's easy, it's the people and international collaboration. You know, space exploration is full of bright and passionate people just like you. So, congratulations again, Solutioneers. Oh, sorry, looks like I have to go help my friends with spacewalk training, so bye-bye. Solutioners don't have anything to work on now. I just got a text from the National Steam Speak Challenge. Since we won, we get to participate in the Steam World Championships. The Solutioners have to come up with a brand new project. Wait, world? Like, the entire planet? 
That's a lot of people. No, no way, no. Kat. You're not going anywhere. So, Solutioneers, what should we work on next?